Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Monet, Houseplant Pixie. Just want to show you a little routine I do most mornings. Use a spray bottle and mist my plants. Not gonna take you around misting all my plants. I was thinking I'll just because why you go around and mist the plants you sort of find if any leaves I rotate my plants and probably be cutting off that leaf there. Sometimes they just pull out. I don't know. So I get my Little secretaries in a minute. Same with this one here. I cut that flower bud off right on the base. Everything looks good with these guys here. Now coming back to the leaves, just all dried leaves cut right at the base. So we're making room for new ones. Got a bit hard. <laughs> I might cut this one as well. Just in between cuttings, make sure you clean your secretaries. I'm gonna cut off some of those leaves on my Picasso lily. And also remember to rotate your plants because they will grow towards the Right. I'm just going to clean my secretaries and cut that old flower bud in a minute. So my secretaries are all cleaned. It's coming from there. And I actually found this leaf. I'm gonna cut as well. Right at the base. And any other dry leaves you see. And she looks all pretty again. Now let's cut some of the old leaves on this Picasso lily. I'm gonna chop this one off. This new leaf is completely. I'm gonna chop that one off too. With the Picasso lily. If you have more green leaves coming out, like that one, I'm going to see how much variegation develops, but I like to cut the fully green, I'm probably going to cut that one off, and maybe that one, and that one doesn't look too pretty, give her a bit of a clean up. And by cutting the green leaves off, you encourage the um, irrigation. 
So let's give her a bit of a haircut. Oh, that lady is coming from here. Excuse my horrible filming, <laughs> it's quite hard to film and So this one here Actually, say this one is coming off I don't know if you can say that so instead of cutting it at the base, I'll be cutting it where the other one, the new leaf is coming in, right there. The other double checked. And let's cut this one. See all the um, flower buds, they are old. Just gonna pull them all out. This plant looks a little bit wilted because we renovated the um, plant room. Got this flooring down, which looks Fantastic. But my plants weren't too happy not being in the sunny spot, the morning sun spot. So I'm just gonna then when you water while I'm at it, just stick your finger in. And this is super dry, so I will give that one a water and show you how much I water at the same time. So I'll clean it up a bit more with all these flower heads off and now I'm gonna give it some water I just like to go around to one round. Oh, there's another. And look at this. This plant is going crazy. It has already new flower heads and heaps of little. I probably should repot it, but I'll leave it. That one here is a new one. You feel it by pulling on it, come out. So let's take it out because in here it has so many new. Sorry, I hope you don't feel no <laughs> little leaves and. On the bottom there so with the watering I don't know if you can see that the water already comes through the bottom see the water sitting in there that's enough water so I only gave it a tiny water that's why I love to have the nursery pot in the decorative pot so there's a little bit of water sitting in the bottom with this particular plan I will tip the water out of the decorative pot and she probably won't need water for another week some people say have a schedule I'll check my plans every second day when I missed 
and every week I water but as I said I stick the finger in the soil if it's dry I will water if it's still moist I won't water it so yeah hope that helps my um, humidifier just kicked in if you would like me to do a little review on this humidifier comment below let me know my fit leaf give the leaves a bit of a clean up guys I hope you enjoyed it if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe comment below if you have any questions look after your plan look after yourself in this tricky time be kind and stay plenty Bye.